What's going on YouTube? This is Jeffrey Howe for Black Gunners in Education. I took a chance the other day, man, I'll say about almost a week ago, and I went and got an offer from VersaCarry. VersaCarry does hold holsters inside the waistband, outside the waistband, leather belts and so forth. They had a deal going on, $50 belt plus holster combo. So I said, you know what? Let me take a look at this $50 belt and holster combo. And look what came today. Ta-da! So I'm going to check this out. And here's the deal with the actual belt itself. It's a double ply belt with the commander holster combo. So let's open it up and see what it looks like. Came, came nicely packaged in a FedEx package. It was $50 for, for the actual items and $8.25 I believe for shipping. So holster and gun belt set together. And I can tell you now the belt is stiff. I can feel that bad boy. So the belt itself is stiff. Def oh my God, this is a good belt. Yo, <laughs> this belt is actually pretty darn nice. Like for real, for real. I am digging this belt, y'all. Take that out, take a look at it. Yo, look at the belt, y'all. So when I say stiff, nice, sturdy, stiff construction, for real. That's pretty impressive. All right, so the belt I'm already impressed with. And man, I'm thoroughly impressed with the belt. Let's see. Brown double ply, 38 inch for my fat belly. Don't judge me, y'all so judgmental out there in the YouTube world. But let's see, let's take a look at the extra holster that comes with it. All right, here it is. And it came in a Ziploc bag, so I ain't got a cutting in on this one, so that, that's, that, that makes, up, makes it very good. All right. And I will tell you this much, the leather is pretty stiff, one of the fellow folks on Facebook had told me that they had had this already and that it was pretty stiff and I told them that I know I would have to loosen it up. So, let me just take a look at how stiff it is. Now, when you actually order it, you have to tell them what type of what type of um, gun it is or firearm that you that you actually want it for and they'll tell you what type. And they got multiple types that you choose from the website. Matter of fact, let me just turn this slightly so y'all can take a look at the website here with me for a little bit. Here's actual, how, the, how the actual website itself looks like when you actually look at the uh, belt and holster combo set. So, not too bad. It's, it's, pretty, it's pretty easy to actually maneuver through. But the gun that I bought it for is my 6R P229. So, let's see. As always, treat a firearm as if it's loaded. So, let's check it. And we have a empty clear chamber here of course so slide the cinder rack forward and supposed to fit in here let's see if it'll fit and guess what like I said it's a little stiff so I have to work it out some mm -hmm. so definitely got to work it in there a little bit so what I may do I may let it sit overnight or so to ensure that it um, gets the right get the uh, right gripping on it. And as you see, it's got the comfort pad here in the back side as well. So that's pretty dope. Let me, let me, there you go, send the, send the hammer down. But so I'm gonna let that sit in there overnight and work on the stiffness of it. But, all right, let's check the belt out with it. Man, when I say that this belt is stiff, this is a good gun belt. I might, I might have to wear this belt just by itself, yo. Man. Ah, as always, I'm carrying even when I'm in the house. So let me take this off real quick. And I'm not gonna put it. I'm not gonna tie it all the way on, but I just wanna get a good fit for it. Oh, hold on, I got this in the way right here. They had said initially to order it like two sizes big or so. I'm glad I didn't because I want my gun to fit nice and tight to my side here. So that's, that would actually be a good fit right there. And where's my magazine at? Magazine! 
Here's my magazine. Had to slide that in there too, so to fit. All right, so I got multiple things I need to do here. Oh, there it is. So I got the magazine holder, and I've got the actual belt itself. I will tell you this much, it don't feel bad at all. Now, of course, I don't have it all the way on my, um, through my loops and everything, but I will tell you this, it's a good fit. It fits very good. I'm impressed by it. But like I said, I'm gonna have to let it sit to loosen up this leather some. So um, I may have to get a little moisture around it or so, oil it up a little bit or something in order for it to, uh, order for it to actually loosen, loosen that belt up. I mean, excuse me, not the belt, but the holster itself up. But I will tell you this, this is my first outside the waistband holster and I actually like it. Let's see, not too, doesn't ride too high. Just right here for a good grab. Now, I'll be honest with y'all, I'm not a fan of outside the waistband holsters. Um, particularly because I live in the state of Florida and we don't have any, uh, <laughs> we don't have open carry, open carry here. So I don't really open carry much except when I'm at the range. But this is good because I like to have my, my SIG 229 on me when I'm at the range. So it's one of my favorite guns to shoot. But one thing I also need to tell you all is that that size one is slated to fit like the Glock 22, um, the Smith & Wesson SN, um, uh, M&P, not the shield, but the M&P full size. So this is not, this is more of a universal large size holster. And that's the style one or the size one that they call it. And um, it actually does fit multiple caliber, I mean multiple um, firearms. So, but I will say this, I actually like it. What I do is once I've let this, let this actually form shape for a while, so it can actually fit. And, Cause right now everything is real tight because the leather has to loosen up for it. But this is my main gun that I'm, that I'm actually have this holster for, but it feels good. And like I said, I'm glad I didn't get a big, um, I'm glad I didn't get like the, the bigger size like they, like they recommended. Cause I, I would want to fit tight here to my side. So I'll be done going. I am a happy camper. I will say I'm sitting down right now. It's comfortable. It's no, no, um, no worries on the way it fit. I can sit here very comfortable. It's not digging into me anything like that, so feels good. So I have to say, for the Versa Carry, you cannot beat it for fifty dollars. Fifty dollars, yo! You have to make sure you use the uh, the code Combo Deal in order to get in order to get the uh, fifty dollars. If not, it's gonna say ninety seven, ninety seven. Was it ninety seven, ninety eight? I believe. But anyway, but uh, if you put the Combo Deal in there, Versa Carry, it's gonna take that fifty dollars off, and then it's um. Only going to be 40. Let's see. It's going, I'm sorry. It's going to take the 47.98 off, so it'll just be 50 dollars. And all I got to do is pay for the shipping. And for two day, FedEx two day is only 8.25. That's what I meant to tell y'all. But like I said, I'm pretty comfortable with this. I actually like this, and I'm glad I stuck with the size belt because it's going to help me help me want actually want to lose a little more weight. I can actually pull it in about one or two more to make it real snug if I wanted to. But this is actually perfect right here, and I actually like it just like it is. So, all right. So I have to say the Versa Carry for. $50 is a thumbs up for me. Um, this is my first and only outside the waistband holster, outside the waistband holster for open carry. No, I'm lying. I did get the, the, the Springfield uh, rebate where they sent, the, sent me the outside, the outside the waistband holster, the OWB. Um, but this is, so this is technically my second one. So let me, I don't wanna be lying. Can't be lying to y'all, cause y'all take things. Y'all be, hey, you remember you said? No, I know how y'all do. Y'all, y'all, y'all petty out there in internet land. But, uh, <laughs> but yeah, I actually like it. Not bad, not bad at all. So what I'm gonna do is, like I said, let this sit for a few days, and get that, take it in and out to get it nice, get that leather nice and loosened up, and um, hopefully, hopefully it'll uh, give me some good draws from it. Cause trying to pull it out right now, trying to pull it out right now, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> so I gotta let it conform to the weapon. And like I said, I got, I got plenty of room in here. That's why I'm glad that I um that's why I'm glad I didn't go as big as they want because then I have all this excess. Sound like we have all that excess um belt hanging over here. I'm not a fan of that, so so yeah, outstanding. Versa carry, thumbs up from Jeffrey Howell. <laughs> all right, y'all. This is Jeffrey Howell from BGOE. To all you out there on YouTube, appreciate you taking the time and watching, and we definitely do appreciate your support. Black Gunners in Education, have a good one now.